No, no, shit. The lighting actually is a lot better laying down. It's like, good morning. Hi. Um, don't mind my eyebrows looking a little mess. I need to brush them. Good morning. I hope you slept well. Or maybe you didn't sleep. I have no idea. I don't know. Anyway, today is the day of the flight. And the flight is at night. So what we're going to do for today is just like last minute things, I guess. Okay, there's really nothing to buy. It's just we are checking that everyone has packed. So everyone has to check that they've packed like everything they need. Um, so what are we doing today is... So we are going to eat breakfast because it's morning and we're going to have lunch because we're going to have a time to have lunch and then um, yeah and then just like many things in what's normally in like my handbag when traveling mask another mask lip stuff wipes laptop ipad airpods bag journals pens a snack hand cream sanitizer purse bonnet because i'm gonna sleep so gotta protect my hair charger Very simple. We are going to the airport. Okay, Okay, let's go. They're gonna kill us. We're late. Thank 
down a bit. Oh, I spoke too soon. It's still loud. Either way, I am on the ground. And the reason I am on the ground is because the type of visa we got, type C visa, does not allow us into London. Because it doesn't allow us into London, we can't go. Fun stuff, right? Fun stuff. So yeah. Um, yeah. Yo guys, I'm back in my room, hey? Wait. I'm tired. It's been a long day. Ah. Uh, so, essentially, at this part of the vlog, right, you're supposed to be seeing me in a plane on my way to London Heathrow, right? But no, that's not what you're seeing. You're seeing me back in my room. Why am I in my room? Because British Airways did us wrong. British Airways did us wrong. Because we got visas, right? We got type C visas and we thought those were the right visas to get, right? Because it's tourism visas. We get there and they're just like, oh, actually, no, you need to have type D visas. But type D visas, okay, that has to be if you are a student or if you're working. We're not doing any of that. We're, we're tourists. We're tourists. Like, what are you talking about? We're not even going to step out of the airport in London, okay? You're just there as a connecting flight, but no. So it's a whole situation, that whole thing, yeah. So I'm I'm just gonna like show you clips of like have I already shown you the clips? 50-50 chance I think I've talked about if I think I've shown you the clips already, or well, I haven't shown you the clips. Editing me is just gonna have to figure out what are they doing. But yeah, guys, uh so we didn't get on the flight obviously like i said i'm back in my room we didn't get on the flight because we couldn't they would not have allowed us <sighs> and we were sitting there for for hours we were just sitting by the gate for hours because now we're trying to figure out what can we do can we do a different airline they were like you can use qatar you can use um what's this other thing emirates and then there's like i can't remember some uk something like that i don't know i don't know i don't know what its name is so then we're just like we're calling these people we're trying to find out what can we do what can we do we're just sitting there like for hours we're sitting there for hours like i went to ended up sitting on the floor because zanilla was on the floor and i was just like babes is it comfortable there and she's like yeah and i was just like okay i sat on the floor with her because it's just like nothing is happening we're sitting on the floor we're just like chilling and then um zingisa arrived so yeah so then, generally, all of us are just there. I'm, I'm on the floor with Zanele. We're chilling, we're playing games. We're just enjoying the floor life whilst, you know, the others are busy talking to the lady at the counter. What can we do and all of that. Um, eventually, eventually, we were able to get a, what is this thing called? A refund, yes. Sorry, I'm tired. Like, today drained me, okay? Today drained me, but I'm tired. <sighs> but I want to keep you guys informed. That's why I'm doing this right now. I want to keep you guys informed of, like, everything that is happening. Because, essentially, that's what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm supposed to keep you informed of everything. So, yeah. That's what happened. Um, we ended up going 
going to get Nando's afterwards. Like, it's a whole ordeal. We just ended up going to Nando's and we got food. We got food from Nando's and it's like, I was upset. Like, I generally was upset because I was expect I was expecting airplane food, okay? Not airport food tonight. But then I got airport food. And not gonna lie, airport food is actually better than plain food. But that is not what I was expecting to be eating as my supper. So it's just like, uh, but Nando's slaps. So it's because it's Nando's. So it was like, Nando's was just like, look, I can fix your mood. I'm good. I'm delicious. I'm tasty. And I was like, okay, Nando's, you are nice. You are good. You are tasty. Because like, you know, it's Nando's. So obviously. But yeah, we ended up getting Nando's. I just really, 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 really really wanted ice cream okay you know how some people are just like oh my gosh i've had such a rough day i need this i need i need alcohol i need i don't know other things people do like whenever they've had a rough day i need ice cream okay when i've had a rough rough day i need ice cream so that's what i did i walked i checked N nando's didn't have any ice cream uh, Wimpy also didn't have ice cream and then Spur Yeah, Spur I always end up like I always like miss, I always mistaken like Steers and Spur but it's Spur 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 had ice cream and ooh That Spur ice cream was good. It made me feel so much better From like how like shitty that day had been it made me feel so much better I appreciated that ice cream so much and then like after eating the ice cream we had to uber back to the house because obviously and then first uber cancelled on us like it told me it was told me that it was eight minutes away it's like okay cool boom your driver has cancelled i'm like huh why why have you cancelled but obviously it's not going to tell me why it cancelled but it cancelled and then i'm like oh okay fine I do another Uber van. I have to do an Uber van because it's a lot of us. I do an Uber van and then we get into the Uber van. Like, the Uber van guy was not, he wasn't nice whatsoever. Like, I, was, I asked him a question, he didn't respond, and I was just like, oh, okay, so this is what we're going to do. Okay, I see you. I see, I see what you're doing there. And then Zing, she, uh, she left her phone. Like, she's just like, where's my phone? Because, like, we're in the Uber now. She's like, where's my phone? We haven't left the airport. We haven't left the airport. She's just, like, getting towards exiting the airport. So, Zing's like, where's my phone? And then she doesn't have her phone. So, they in Promise, who's also going on the trip with us, calls Zing's phone. And then some lady answers. And she's just like, hi, I'm not the owner of this phone. But I found this phone in blah, blah, blah. And then Zing's like, hi, oh my gosh, thank you so much. I'm the owner of this phone. Where can I meet you? And the person's like, oh, okay, I'm going to be a chicken licking. And this is the hair color. And this is my hair color. So you can, like, spot me. And then we were just like, okay, cool. And then, like, obviously the Uber driver can hear this. And then we are asking him, like, multiple times, can he stop the Uber so we can get out and get the phone? And then he's just like, oh, is the person going to come to you? What do you mean is the person going to come to us? Like you you heard this conversation. It was a loudspeaker. You heard this conversation. You know that we have to get out of the Uber to go get the phone and then come back. Eventually. This dude was he was moving so slow. Moving so slow. So slow. He was moving slow as hell. Either way, eventually I get out of the Uber with Zing. We go get Zing's phone. We come back into the Uber dead silence the drive back home dead silence because everyone is tired and then you know we get back to the house and now i'm dylan and zanele took a different uber because of how many people we are they took a different uber so then we get back to the house and now we're just like okay how are we going to get to ibiza ibiza Still don't know which one to say. Either way, Ibiza. So we're just like, how are we going to get to Ibiza? Because like, you know, flights and all of that. But then eventually we found an airline to use. The prices were, the prices, the airline prices were like, yeah, it happened, hey. And then like, we just spent, 
like an hour or two just like trying to do all this airport pricing stuff and then making sure everyone has a ticket and just trying out where everyone's sitting so it's just like it was a lot it was a lot but eventually we can breathe now because tickets have been bought and paid for seats as well our visas work for this airline it's gonna take us from um Joburg to germany and then germany to visa and it's just like you know it's fine it's fine we accept it our visa is accepted so um yeah that is that's how today went i am so tired like today has drained me i know i already said this but i need to reiterate myself today drained me like all of this happened just because we didn't have a certain type of visa that was never communicated to us when we were applying for the visa when we were booking our tickets anything like that no it was not communicated whatsoever so it's just like ah, oh, guys really but no because of that um our trip got shifted so it's gonna be the our trip got shifted that's that's pretty much it our trip got shifted so next time i have the next vlog that comes out after this is going to be take two of this travel vlog because then we would actually be getting on a plane and i'll be like talking to you guys whilst on the plane but like c'est la vie right c'est la vie guys i want to want to go sleep now hey i'm gonna go sleep but you know thank you for watching this vlog i appreciate every single one of you for like just taking the time out of your day to watch my vlogs so yeah thank you so much for watching this vlog please comment like subscribe share turn on new notifications because you know the whole of october i'm just going to be posting and posting and posting and posting and posting and even when i have nothing to post i will still post yeah i'm that determined to do this entire like vlogtober challenge thing okay that's it bye <laughs>